Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you guys are new. My name is Xiao. Today's video is going to be a video of me decluttering my clothes. So it's finally starting to feel like spring outside. I live in Minnesota and literally just last weekend we had one of the biggest snowstorms in history. We had over like 15, even more than that, inches of snow. And tomorrow is supposed to be one of the warmest days we've had in the past six months. So it just kind of shows you guys how unspring like it's felt here. So I wanted to start my spring cleaning by decluttering my clothes before we get into the video I do want to mention that I will be partnering with Poshmark in this video I've never worked with them before but I have mentioned them in one of my previous video which was a um, how to earn money while in college I've had a Poshmark closet even before I started YouTube so I used to sell clothes and makeup on there and I think it's a great way to earn a little bit of money for things that you don't want anymore so yeah I just wanted to be totally transparent with you guys but if you guys would like to see me declutter my clothes and then definitely just keep on watching all right so we're gonna tackle the closet first up top here I have these bins that hold my swimsuits and more formal dresses and then of course we have all of the clothes that are hanging and then I do have these two hanging little shelf thingies that hold all my sweaters or cardigans um, so first we're gonna start off with the bins I'm gonna start off with the formal dresses I'm just gonna go through each one of them decide if I want them or not and I did decide to keep a lot of them just because I haven't had a chance to wear them and I still do really like them so um, I'm gonna make a pile for donating for selling and then one for putting it back into my closet Next up are my swimsuits. You guys, I have a lot of swimsuits, but I promise you I got rid of a lot of them last summer. You guys know I do a lot of collabs and I get sent a lot of swimsuits, but these are the ones that I wear the most and that I see myself wearing them. So I did go ahead and um, put a pile to sell or give away. Um, so I'm just going to put those bins back up in my closet because these are the ones that I'll be keeping. Next are all my sweaters that were in that little hanging cubby thing. This part gets messy so often because I wear a lot of these for work on a daily basis. So I'll try them out in the morning and then whichever ones I don't like, I'll just like stuff them back in so it gets really, really messy. A lot of these I'm keeping just because, again, I do still really like them. Um, once I'm done deciding and folding them, I'll put them back into the little cubbies. And then I did have some more sweaters that were um, already folded from laundry day a couple of days before. So I'm just going to go ahead and put these back into the little cubbies. Next, I'm going to go through the hanging shirts. I just go through each one of them and just kind of ask myself, when's the last time I wore this? Am I ever going to wear it again? Um, I think a hard part about me getting rid of clothes that even I don't plan on wearing again is just because, you know, I spent money on it and I keep asking myself or telling myself, you know, what if I will wear this? But I did end up getting rid of a lot of them. I'm going to sell some, I'm going to donate some, and then some I did throw it in the trash just because like the quality wasn't the greatest anymore. Um, but just some things to ask yourself when you're going through clothes that you may or may not need anymore next are the drawers so this IKEA drawer the top three all belong to me so in this drawer particularly are like smaller crop tops and skirts and shorts and stuff like that that can't really be hung so I just keep them on here a lot of these are like really really cute summer clothes and I haven't worn them in a while just because it hasn't been warm where I live so I am keeping a lot of these and some of them I've never worn before some of them are still really good quality and I do see myself wearing them so that is why I'm not throwing out much of this but that is it for that drawer and then you guys I have clothes everywhere so in our side table um, our bedside table I have like just random wires phone chargers um, batteries and stuff like that so I'm gonna clean those out and in here I have mainly my workout clothes honestly I haven't been to the gym in like like a month or so but I'm gonna clean out all my gym uh, leggings that I haven't worn in a while or that are way too small or way too tight for me I do wear a size small but I feel like sometimes it's really really restricting especially depending on the material that they're made of so I did go ahead and get rid of a lot of the leggings which will also be posted on my Poshmark so check those out Alright, so this is the pile of clothes that I plan to sell on my Poshmark. So let's go ahead and open up um, the Poshmark 
app and again I already have it downloaded because I've used it even before I started YouTube so this is just what the new feed um, page looks like and then when you click into your closet well this is what my closet looks like I have a really old profile profile picture because I told you guys my Poshmark closet is really old I have a couple old makeup items that I sold when I first started so now all you want to do is give a little photo shoot to all your clothes you want to sell. You want to get good angles, good lighting, get the front and back, even better if you can try it on. Um, that's great because you know you don't want to buy something you don't really want to know what it looks like on. Um, so I'm just taking a bunch of photos and then I'm going to go ahead and post it. So as you guys can see my photos have been taken. I'm just going to add in a little title so I'm adding in peplum denim jacket. And then you want to add in a little bit more details because, of course, it's nice to know what you're buying or what you're looking at. And then you want to choose your category. I'm just going to choose jacket, jean jackets. And then um, you want to do your size. Um, I believe this was a small. I got it a long time ago. And then now you just want to add in the original price. Again, I don't remember exactly, but I think it was around $20. And I'm just going to sell for $8. Um, I kind of base it off of the quality if I've worn it a lot and anything like that. So you can also share this on your other social media like Pinterest and Facebook and stuff. But I'm just going to go ahead and list it on my Poshmark. And once you do list, you can click into your closet and there's your new listing. These are some of the other clothing items that I will be posting on my Poshmark. This is a really pretty black sequined dress that I got a while ago and I've never got a chance to wear it. Uh, I really really like it though. I think it's really classy and very sexy at the same time. The back is an open low cut back and it fits really really well. This is really good quality. And then I will be posting in this white kind of like off the shoulder type of dress as well. It's really cute. Again I never got a chance to wear it. I just kind of like tucked it away and totally forgot about it but it's still in really good um, quality so these are all the things I'll be posting on my Poshmark I already have them listed up so I will have my Poshmark closet link down below so make sure to check that out and also download the app again it's free so these are all of my items that I have on my closet so check it out guys Not only can you sell stuff on Poshmark, you can buy things as well. So I like to look up brands such as like Lulu's, Toby, and stuff like that. Um, Poshmark does have a lot of like Nike, Louis Vuitton, Michael Kors, really high-end brands that are like literally like up to 80% off just because, you know, they're used, gently used clothes. So definitely check them out. Again, feel free to download the free app down below. I have a bag of clothes here that I'm not going to be selling. I'm, I will be donating these and then I have other clothes that I have already tossed out but yeah that's pretty much it all right guys that is it for my video i hope you guys found it somewhat helpful again like i stated i will leave my link to my closet down below if you guys want to check out and see what i have for sale also if you guys are interested in opening a poshmark account please make sure to click the link that i have listed in the description box it's a free app to download and if you guys do end up selling stuff on poshmark please make sure to leave your closet handle in the comments down below i would love to check them out so thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye guys